there are a lot of different ways to go about greater division when you've got these bigger dividends, and one is place value sections method of division. If you like the place value sections method of multiplication, then this may be your preferred method for division as well. Just like in place value sections multiplication, what we've done is we've drawn out a visual that has the uh, the, the sections that, that are likely to be in the quotient of a number that has a dividend with three digits. 834 is our dividend. We're going to try to divide that into six different ways. The way we're going to go about that is place value by place value. So the first question we're going to ask ourselves is, okay, how many hundreds of groups of six can we get out of 834? Well, immediately in my head I'm thinking, well, if I have a hundred groups of six, that's 600. If I had 200 groups of six, well, that would be 1,200, which is way too much. So I can't get more than 100 groups of six. Well, let's try that. 100 groups of six, that means that I can, if I make 100 groups of six, I've dealt with 600 of the pieces in my dividend that I'm dividing up. So what do I have left that I still need to put in groups of six? Well, let's do a little bit of subtraction. And I've got 234. I can't get any more hundreds of groups of six out of that. So now I'm going to try and say, well, how many tens of groups of six can I get out? So I'm going to regroup that over into the tens section. And then I'm going to start to think again. I'm going to think, well, okay. I know 10 groups of 6 is 60. 20 groups of 6 is 120. 30 groups of 6 would be 180. 40 groups of 6 would be 240. That's too much. So in my head I'm thinking, okay. What was 30? Whoops. Bloop, 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 bloop. <laughs> groups of 6. Ah, uh, That was 180. And I definitely can't do 40 because that goes above my number. So I can get 30 more groups of 6 out of, of what I have left here. And I'm going to need to remove those. And I'm going to have 54 left, 18, 19, 20, 20 23, yeah. I'm going to have 54 left. Now I can still make groups of 6 out of that as well. So, so far I've got 100 groups of 6 plus 30 groups of 6. Now let's see. How many groups of 6 are there in 54? Well, good news. I know this one. It's a math fact. Because 9 times 6 is 54. So... I can make nine more groups of six, which means I have everything in groups of sixes, which is what I was going for. So what I have up here would be called partial dividends. So 100 groups and 30 groups and nine groups. Now I want my whole dividend together, so I'm just going to add those. 100 plus 30 plus 9 It's going to get me... 139. So there are 139 groups of 6 in 834. That is the basics for place value sections division.